Hey guys, and I'm back with another video. So today's video, I just want to report, um, they're basically saying the singer Keisha Coles, her and, um, her new baby dad, um, Nico Kale has officially broken up, guys. I'm like, it's just crazy out here because, you know, she was just on a Nick Cannon, um, podcast a few months ago, you know, defending a relationship, you know, getting mad with Nick when Nick was saying, you know, that she was like, um, you know, a cougar or something like that. And she's like, I'm not a cougar. I'm not a fucking cougar and all this other shit. But I'm like, come on now, Keish. Like, you 38. Like, he's 24. He's a, he's a, he's a man child. He's a boy. Like, what do y'all really have in common? You feel what I'm saying? Like, you know, I don't understand. You know, I try not to judge or however the case may be. But, you know, guys that's like around our age as it is. Like, you know, because I'm 36. So, guys that's in their 30s is still young-minded and wet behind the ears. And basically, like, they still sucking on their mother's titty for real. So, you know, how did you really think that that was going to work? How did you think... That was going to last. And then, you know, you had a baby bomb. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you have a beautiful baby boy. And, you know, that's a good thing. You know, babies are always a blessing. But on the same token, you know, who couldn't tell that this relationship was not going to last? Like, you know, come on now. Like, you are a beautiful woman. You should have tried to get with somebody, like, around your age or you know, a little bit older than you because guys that's like younger, way younger than us, and it's like a 15 year age gap. Like you're th you're 38 and he's 24. So, you know, you basically, you know, old enough to be his mom. So how did you really think that was going to work? You feel what I'm saying? Like you basically, like, you basically got to tell him everything to do to please you. Yeah. He might've been you might have felt like he was a little mature for his age or however the case may be, but you know what I'm saying? It seemed like he probably was nothing but like a clout chaser. Like he got with you to get his music career, you know, going. And on top of that, like I listened to some of um, Nico Kale's music and he has some nice, you know, he got some nice music or however. He could really rap, you know. You know, he's talented, but it just seemed like he just got with you, you know just for the clout purposes, like, you know. Oh, I could milk this situation, you know what I'm saying? I could turn my dreams into reality. And, you know, I could be this mega star. I could be, like, you know, the next NBA young boy or the next Lil Wayne or, you know, whoever, you know what I'm saying? So it's just, like, it's unfortunate that things did not work out, but you should have known that, Keish. You should have just kept it as, like, a little fling, a little wham-bam, thank you, ma'am, or, you know, friends with benefits. You know, you should have never made that, made him your main dude. If anything, you should have tried to work things out with your husband, you know, Booby, Daniel Booby Gibson. You should have tried to work it out with him. Why would you go to that little youngin? He couldn't really offer you nothing. You know what I'm saying? I see. I did see a cute little video of him um, cutting your son, cutting Keisha Cole's hair. Um, Keisha Cole's son hair, Daniel um, Junior, and he did a really good job. He had cut his hair into like a mohawk and stuff like that, or however. So. You know, he seemed like he was being a little good little stepdad or however the case may be. But, you know, you can't really keep, you can't really control no little young. And she might have thought because she's older than him, you know, and that she basically probably paying all the bills. And, you know, she Keisha Cole, like she, you know, she's the star, like. He gonna sit there and listen to everything that she says, but he fooled her. He like shit, you know what I'm saying? It just seemed like, you know, I'm quite sure he lo he he loves her, but he's still he's young. Like he was born in what 1995. Like what the fuck? You was probably like in middle school or going to high school, Keisha Cole. Like when he was first born. Like come on now. Like how did you think that was gonna work? That's too much of an age age gap. Yeah, you know, people be saying age ain't nothing to, age ain't nothing but a number, but really it is, you know. He's a baby, you know what I'm saying? 
So you send him back to his mother and let him keep sucking on his mother titty, you know. Let him keep, you know, sucking all the breast milk out. Let him keep sucking all the breast milk out of his mother titty because he's too young. Like, you know, y'all have nothing in common. What do y'all really have to talk about? Like, you know. I would just love to sit at that 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 dinner table, that Sunday dinner table and see what really what really do y'all ha have in common? You know, like He's not on your level, like, intellectually, like, his mind, his body, his nothing is not, like, you almost damn near 40 years old. What did you think a 23-year-old could really do for you? You know, that's just how I feel, like, he couldn't offer you nothing, but, like, you know, a little, you know. You already know I wanna be explicit on the show, but I mean explicit on my YouTube channel, but what could he offer you besides sex? You know? What else did y'all have in common? What can y'all really possibly have in common? What can y'all really be talking about? So I'm really not surprised, you know. I just wish I just wish Keisha could find somebody that, you know, that really love her and, you know, but would be a good man to her, you know what I'm saying? Cause, you know, even though she makes some bangers, like when she make the breakup songs and the heartbroken songs, but I want her to find happiness with like a good dude, somebody around her age or somebody that's a little older than her. But he's a baby, Keisha. Let his ass go. If he wanna go, if he don't wanna stay with you, you don't need him. Shit, you Keisha Cole, you a beautiful woman. You don't need that nigga. Send him back packing to his mama, you know, let his mama deal with his ass. Because it seemed like he just tried to use you anyway for the clout to get his career started or however. Then, you know, after he feel like, you know, he got enough followers on Instagram or YouTube or however. Or people kind of like know who he is now. Like, he tried to curry you and I don't like that. But, I mean, I know you're going to be all right, Keisha. You always do, you know. And I'm not really, you know, trying to, you know, be judgmental or, like, preach to you. But anybody could have seen that coming a mile away. Like, you, you know, you could do better than that. You don't need no little young boy that's still wet behind the ears, that still don't know nothing, you know. He haven't even really lived life for real. He ain't nothing but 24. Like, so what can y'all really have in common with each other? He really can't do nothing for you. I'm quite sure you are the breadwinner. I don't care if he got a job or he, you know, he rap and he might, you know, I don't know, make a little money from rapping or, you know, whatever he do. But, you know, you the breadwinner of the house. Like, what could he really do for you? He's a little kid. He like He's like a son to you, basically, you know. He's old enough that... You know, he can be your son. I mean, he's young enough. He's young enough to be your son, basically. You're 38 years old, and he's 24. So, what? you know, how did you think that really was going to work? But, I mean, I wish you the best, Keisha Coles. And um, that's all I have to say on that. Please, guys, like, share, and subscribe to my video. Give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye, guys.